Hey guys, I'm Sean Cheek coming at you from Waco, Texas. Today we're going to learn how to play a song by Tom Waits called Old 55. Let's take a listen. All right, beautiful piano part in this one. Guys, welcome to our online piano community. We have a lot of people discovering us lately and coming over to us and signing up on the website. Welcome everyone. Uh, at webpianoteacher.com, we like to gather together to learn, play, and share the music we love, creating a culture of encouragement for all you guys out there who are trying to play piano online. You can do it if you pick the right lessons and you know how to practice. I'm going to help with that today, so let's get right into it. <clears throat> So again, welcome everyone who's coming over. We've having a lot of new memberships, a lot of people deciding to uh, spend their time playing piano these days in the house. So uh, we're so excited about that. We want you to get on the right track, though. The worst thing you can do is try to play something that's too hard or to try to do too much at one time. So you need to pick the right lessons as far as something you like. It needs to be a song you like. There are lots of easy songs out there that you could be playing to build up where you can play harder songs but enjoy those easier songs first and let yourself give yourself time to get better and better over time okay <clears throat> another thing you want to pick is something that's not too hard so something you like and something that's not too hard and you can find that if you search and I have so many lessons on the website that you can do that um, so you know let's get right into it get into the board here we have a lot of flats you can see on the board uh, but don't be afraid of that playing in flats and sharps is just a matter of getting used to it all right, we have my uh, lovely MP11 SC Kawhi in the studio today. Have a concert grand sound on. And uh, just love it. <clears throat> so we're going to have kind of a swing rhythm. Bum, ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. So you might just want to, you know, drum your fingers on a desk or something to get used to that rhythm. I have a pair of bongos here in the studio. And that's always a good way to get used to a rhythm is just kind of hitting those bongos and bum, 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 bum. bum. That. <clears throat> the first measure we have a G flat chord. So here's middle C and we're down here. G flat, D flat, G flat with the left hand, 5, 2, 1. And we're going to go bum, 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 bum. Now here I don't hear the left hand continue that, but I'm going to do it anyway <clears throat> because I need something to continue on. I don't have a band with me, I'm just piano solo. And I want the left hand to, to uh, keep carrying us through. So I'm going to keep playing that pattern in that measure anyway. Um, so, bum, 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 bum in the first measure. The right hand is going to have little, uh, it's actually a country sixth. You always hear me say country third. Well, there's also such a thing as a country sixth. If, if I don't do it this way, I can do it this way. <laughs> I can bump the D flat down here, and I have a country sixth. It's pretty much the same thing as a country third. It's just inverted. So D flat and A flat together, and then I'm going to flip up to the B flat. You can go fingers three to four, thumb on the D flat. So the first measure is, the second measure we start out the same way, we go back to the D flat, A flat, and then D flat, G flat. Notice the D flat's on the thumb the whole time. So one, two, okay? And then <clears throat> D flat, F, on the right left hand has B flat, F, B flat, F. So the same da, 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 da pattern we had here. So if this is, you know, you don't have to play more left hand in there. I was just saying I was doing it for me. Um, so that's up to you whether you do it or not. Same thing here. You can keep the left hand going. I don't hear it in the recording, but I'm playing it because I just want it to keep moving. So D flat, F together with one, two. We flipped to G flat with the third finger back to F, back to D flat, G flat. So... Now we're going to D flat, G flat still. Left hand's going to go to B natural. I also could have called that a C flat, but that freaks a lot of people out. So we'll just call it a B. Instead of C flat's kind of weird, huh? B, G flat, B, G flat. Bum, bum, bum. So one, two. And then I play D flat, A flat right at the end of that. Then it's going to go up to D flat there, and we have another country sixth. So let's go from the beginning. And go one. So, 
there is our part one lesson. If that was really super difficult for you, you're probably trying lessons that are too hard. And I love that you love this song, but there are other songs that you probably love that you can do that are on a, on a more basic level. Tons of them on the site. Take a look. Now, if you had a pretty easy time with that, I bet you could play the rest of it. No problem. And again, guys, see you on the website. I had a great time today. Talk to you later.